اعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الواحد الله سبحانه وتعالى within the 66th name within the asma'ul husna Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is described as al-wahid meaning the one the all inclusive and the indivisible Allah the one who is unique in his in his essence and unrivaled unparalleled and unmatched in his perfection he has no partner no equal and no rival and there is absolutely nothing like unto him the one and only god lord of all the creation who requires no second or partner and is alone in his divinity the only one worthy of worship whose decree is to be followed and observed and of whom nothing can share in the obedience and worship that is due to him it has been said that whoever recites the name al wahid the one who recites this name alone and in a quiet place will be free from fear and delusion so whoever recites the name al wahid in a quiet and alone place then inshallah they will be free from fear and delusion allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in the holy quran leave me alone to deal with him whom i have created alone this is in surah al mudathir and one of the quotes of rumi alayhi rahma says that that voice which is the origin of every cry and sound that indeed is the only voice and the rest are only echoes subhanallah so the use of the word voice here is a metaphor for the great the great wisdom of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala who is one everyone and everyone else wisdom and everyone else's existence is just ripples in the water or just an echo of the one and only existing allah who has always been and will always be pray that allah subhanahu wa ta'ala grants us all jannatul firdaus amin and accepts all of our ibadah to the one and only allah in this holy month amin